This is Apple Card. In Apple's dictionary, it's probably magical, phenomenal, smart, yet simple credit card that will change the way you think about credit cards. How do we think about credit cards? Let's not talk about that. But I can assure you, it's gonna change. Because it can do this. And here it is! Apple Card comes in this nicely designed box. Inside the box we're greeted with uh, the card. To activate the card what you have to do is if you have an iPhone XS or XS Max just wake your phone up and hold it next to the card. If you have iPhone X or earlier go to your wallet app, select the card and hit activate. The titanium card is laser etched with the customer's name. And to achieve this white part over the titanium, they applied a multi-layer coating. Now let's go into the wallet app. And there it is, the Apple card. Let's tap on that. And immediately you can see that my card turned green. The card displayed on the screen changes color accordingly to what you last purchased. And what I last purchased was a hotel room. If you buy food and drinks, it's orange, pink is for entertainment, and green is for travel. Apple says this is a very secure card. If it detects an unusual activity, it asks you to approve it on your phone. It can be useful in both ways. Obviously, it can stop the people who are trying to use your card to buy stuff, which is really difficult because even if you get this card, it doesn't have your number. But in case they did, you will still get a notification. On the other hand, you can be somewhere else. All of a sudden you fly to another continent and you want to use your card and it looks like a suspicious activity. Instead of your card being blocked, you can just approve it by yourself on your phone. You can see your balance here. And you, when you tap on your balance, you're greeted with this screen. You're immediately notified with the daily cash back you got. We're going to talk about that more in a little bit. And then you see your weekly activity. And then we have payments. And when you go into your payments, it shows you the interest charges. Right now it doesn't have any interest charges. But it motivates you to pay in full. So you're not stuck with a credit card debt, which is good. And then underneath that, we're seeing some tips teaching you how to use this card. If you go to a place that doesn't accept Apple Pay and if you use this card, you get 1% cash back. If you use Apple Pay to buy stuff online, you'll get 2% cash back. And if you use it in Apple Store or the places where they have agreement with, like right now it had, they have agreement with Uber and Uber Eats, you will get 3% cash back. Now, when I use this card, I bought my hotel room through Hotel Tonight app. And when I got to the hotel, this wasn't with me, this just arrived. And the person at the reception wanted to see my card. In that case, what you can do is you can go in here and then you can view your card information, which I don't like to show it to you right now maybe later. In case something happens, you can lock your card, you can request a replacement card. For example, if it gets dirty and you don't want to clean it with a little bit of rubbing alcohol, which is what Apple says on their website to maintain the beauty of this titanium card. And Apple seems to really care about privacy and they say they have no idea what you're buying with this card. And if you need to contact someone regarding this card, you can visit the website, you can call them or you can simply message them and here you can also see how much daily cash you got and for your daily cash you may be wondering where's my daily cash it's in your cash app displayed right here you can also schedule payments or make a payment right away you can make this default card at apple which is a great idea i think i shopped there a little bit not too much, but a little bit. Fantastic, I just got help. 
So am I worried that I got myself buried more into the Apple ecosystem? Oh yeah, I'm so worried that I'm in a terrible ecosystem where I can copy a text on my computer and paste it on my phone. Oh no, what am I gonna do? What if I want to leave the Apple ecosystem? Well, the solution is simple. I'll go to Apple store, buy everything using the Apple card and they will eat each other and then they will cancel each other and I can go back to my Amex. Well, thank you very much for watching this short but sweet episode and I hope you enjoyed it. Please hit that subscribe button. I must have a subscribe button somewhere here on the screen. Hit that subscribe button and play Ding Dong Ditch. Maybe I shouldn't touch that in here. Play Ding Dong Ditch with the bell next to it and join the world domination. And please let me know what you think about Apple Card in the comment section below. And until I see you the next time, take really good care of yourselves and hoşçakalın.